Welcome to Critterland. Look what I have. This is the Calico Critters Sylvanian Family's Duck Family, recently released this year. Uh, this was from Amazon Japan, and I spent about $26 on this set uh, as part of a larger order, so the shipping was brought down to about $5, and that brought it to about $32, which is really amazing considering on eBay it's like $40 bucks to $50 depending on where you get it. And I'm also going to wheel out the little ducklings that are also fairly recent uh, from 2021. These were a gift from my husband. He totally surprised me. I refused to buy them because they were so expensive, but he did, and they're just so cute. And so I can't wait to open up the new duck family and compare the ducklings. But first, let's take a quick look at the ducks uh, from back in the day. This is the very first duck family, the Puddleton Duck family from 1988. This is part of the Urban Life series, and it looks they look identical to the ones that have come out uh, in 2021. I don't see really any differences. It's so amazing. And then after that, the Puddleford Duck family uh, came out in 1990 and then had a few other releases uh, as well as in the USA. And they've got uh, more kind of classic, simpler clothing. So adorable. I love them. And then Mr. Webster the Milkman came out a couple years after that. And he had one re-release. Definitely a collector's item. Uh, I love his darker uh, fur or feathers. <laughs> um, we don't have him or any of these. Uh, the Waddlington Duck uh, family came after that. They've got the gold medals because they were the mayor and mayoress. And the ducklings are a darker brown color. How cool! And those are all the ducks that I know of um, until now uh, when we have the duckling triplets and then the duck family. And as far as I know, this is only available as a Japanese import. I, it might be available in the UK. Um, you all might know better than me. I just haven't seen a UK package for it. Look how gorgeous that packaging is. I mean, they really pull out all the stops. You probably know this was released. Uh, they had a little contest. Uh, we voted uh, on uh, on which one to, uh, you know, basically uh, revive, and the ducks were the winners. And I love how they really kept the uh, molds and the clothing true to the very first duck family they put out in 1988. And they're just so gorgeous. Everything about them are just amazing. They don't stand up. They're awkward. So they do stand up fine, but um, they're not like the other critters. They just have a different design. Uh, they have the plastic legs and, uh, you know, the um, just a different leg shape. So they're just uh, different. And they, it takes a little getting used to. <laughs> but look how gorgeous and handsome this man is. He is just adorable. I love his outfit. I love his little wings and his little overalls and the big buttons and the bow tie. Ah, oh, how cute. He's just so chubby and he's got that big tail sticking out. You can see those feet are hard plastic, just like the ones in 1988. I don't think they changed the mold. I think it's the exact same critter. And look at that beautiful top hat. And it rests on his head. It's a little woobly, um, but it looks really cute when it's on him. And then here is Mother Duck. I love her bonnet. She is just so classically gorgeous. I love all the frilly lace. And you can see she kind of looks like a chicken on the bottom with those just kind of circular joints on her legs. Beautiful dress. I don't know if this would fit other critters. Looks like it's designed special for her body. Kind of see their body type back there. A little bit of a more uh, narrow neck. And that bonnet is really on there very tightly. I'm afraid to take it off, although I want to, because that bow is tied so beautifully. I don't want to mess it up. And here are the ducklings. Oh my gosh. So cute. And their beaks uh, are the same color as their body, along with their little feetsies. Now here, the beaks are pinkish on the uh, on the duckling set. The one on the right uh, is the, duck, the triplet duckling set. 
but the mold looks pretty much exactly the same. Uh, the ones that came in the duck family have a slightly lighter color on their fur and they have simpler little kind of like bibs that they're wearing. Um, but very beautiful. And these ribbons are tied. There is no Velcro. There's no elastic. I mean, this is like a very kind of old fashioned design here. And just lovely, but that would make it hard to take the, uh, the outfits on and off, so I'll have to keep that in mind. Uh, with these ones here that came separate, um, they can be removed with elastic, those little, uh, those little hoodies. Well, thanks for taking a look, and I will see you next time.